Yo, what's good, fellas? Welcome back to the channel, man. I'm excited to bring you guys this gameplay right here. We went ahead and picked up all of the cars that were dropped today. We locked in. We got the Draymond Green. And I literally just hopped off of Unlimited. And I got to show you guys this Chris Webber gameplay right here, man. This Diamond Chris Webber, guys, I'm telling you, he's fired. The only negative with the card is that he's 6'9". I was running him at the center spot. You'll see why my matchup allowed me to do that. Um, but this card right here, man, it is just fire. He feels really fast. He plays really good defense, and he's able to get buckets. 92 overall, power forward, center. Um, man, the card is really good, yo. He's 6'9", like I said. You know, that's the only negative with the card if you're going to run him at the 5. But, yo, 79 driving layup. He's got some pretty good post moves. He's a 94 with the shoe, 91 with the shoe. He's got a 90 mid-range, a 75 three ball, which is very usable. 88 driving dunk with the shoe, guys. So, I'm telling you, man, he's, he's really nice. 82 steal, which is good on the big. 89 block rating the rebounding is fire too. 87 offensive 91 defensive rebounding and then the speed for a big 81 speed 70 speeder ball so it's actually pretty good he is not gonna get bullied he's got an 88 strength 98 stamina 85 vertical lateral quickness is still suspect none of these bigs right now in the game have a good lateral quickness i would say draymond green in comparison with with the lateral quickness he's the only one that they haven't really slept on it's like a 78 and it's really not that good yeah the card comes with three hall of fame badges full spin technician break starter rebound chaser nine gold badges 13 silver badges and two bronze badges you could obviously add more badges yourself so that's always a plus but yeah fellas i don't want to talk too much man just enjoy the gameplay uh, i'm still kind of trying to figure out how i'm gonna use this card if i'm gonna bring him off the bench i don't really like him at the five because he's six nine yet he could take advantage uh, of being at the five because of the speed so we're gonna have to figure that out as we go but yeah man he's definitely in the lineup either at the four or the five i'm gonna find a way to run him because he's a really really solid card enjoy the gameplay all right boys we found the matchup and it's actually a good matchup he's got the chris weber at the five he's got draymond green at the four so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take Porzingis out the lineup. We're going to go Chris Webber against Chris Webber. We're going to put Porzingis to the bench and see what we can do. There you go. Chris Webber with the first rebound. I'm looking for PG right here. Snatch. Wide open mid-range. I got to get the greens. I got to. Get a little pick and roll going. Webber, cut to the rim. Good speed. Good speed. Okay, I'm liking that. Good defense. See, that's what I'm going to like about uh, Draymond Green. He's got that Hall of Fame Intimidator right there. We don't get the outlet pass, but yo, Green's defense should be phenomenal. All right. Inbound to uh, Chris Webber right here. Watch out. Draymond. Loki was open there. I'm going to look for Steve Nash. Wide open. Look, he's not missing that. Steve Nash is not missing that, boys. He's got a very high three ball rating. I love it. All right. Pick and roll. Steve Nash and Webber. That's a mismatch right here. We're going to take advantage of it for sure. Drop step him. Too easy. Too easy. Just too easy. We got the little guy on us. Chris Webber. Finding the open Paul George. Back to Chris Webber. Is a blow by right here. Corner. I love it. PG is green right now. Good defense. All right. Chris Webber. Show me the speed, yo. Dennis Rodman on him. I don't care. I don't care. Good speed. Okay. Chris Webber is a little demon. Wide open right here. Hold up. I'm going to get this ISO real quick. Chris Weber at the top. Hold up. Damn, son. Hold up. Listen. Chris Weber got the moves. Good defense. Good board, Weber. Let's give it to Dream on here. Oh, we got a mismatch. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. I got to eat. I got to eat. I gotta eat. I got to. He's got post takeover right now, boys. Oh, look at him. Look at him. Look at him. Quick, dude. He's just fast. Good defense. Good defense. Look at the recovery. Oh, yeah. Gotta keep getting him in, in a pick and roll scenario. We have to. Gets the mid-range to go. Yo, that's a 15-point first quarter for the boy. Good defense. Another rebound for Chris Weber. Hold on. I'm trying to hit him with a cross over here. Slow, but he got it. He got it. He got it. Dude, he's a beast. All right, boys. He tied the game up, man. We got to get some offense. We've gone cold. Chris, Chris Weber's cold here for a second. It's okay. 
all the way though. He is just not stopping the, the drive. He's yeah, he's really focused on stopping uh, Chris Webber right now. Good defense. Wide open. Allen Houston ahead of the pack. And he makes that. Wow, we'll take the assist with Chris Webber. Alright, pick and roll with Chris Webber. Gotta get him involved. Under the rim. He's on a jump right here. Wasn't even letting me shoot, yo. Still draw the foul. Open in the corner. Super late on the contest. Allen Houston does not miss. Keep running him on the pick and roll, dude. And he takes advantage. 21 points in the first half. Good defense. That's an assist for the boy. Allen Houston. Money. Alright. He's zoning me, boys. He's zoning me, fellas. I got to start drilling threes. He's just zoning me now. Green Bean is zoning me. All right, guys. So the Chris Webber gameplay right now is about to go to shit since he's uh, running a zone. We're going to be able to make our shots, so that's a good thing. Got to go ahead and uh, drive in with Kobe right here. Give it to Chris Webber. We're going to post him up. And send the double right there. And that's money with Kobe. He leaves me right here. I'm looking for Kobe on this one. Hold on. There it is. There it is. Contested. It don't matter because you're zoning. Let's go. Left open in the corner. Can he hit a three? Ooh, he fouled me though, so we'll definitely take that. He's got to kill the zone here somehow. Open in the corner. Draymond. Don't sell me. Don't sell me, Draymond Green. Good D. Weber with the rebound. Let's go. And now we're going to the line. Good D. And an assist. Let's go. Not going to lie. I've missed like three free throws with him. But that's just because I'm messing around too much. Good D. Here we go. That's another assist for the boy. Draymond. Throw it down. Show me. All right, we're running away with it, man. I'm hoping he doesn't rage quit so we can get a nice little uh, gameplay here with Chris Webber. Good D. Another assist. Oh, we're going to the line. We're going to the line, and that's the rage quit. That sucks. That sucks, but that's a hell of a gameplay for Chris Webber, guys. I mean, the card is just... He's really fast in comparison to all the other bigs. He's going to be able to hit the mid-range. He can hit the outside. Obviously, he could pass. I was on pace for a triple-double right there, and he's actually rebounding really good. He has some pretty decent rebounding stats, so yeah. There you guys have it, yo. Diamond Chris Webber absolutely tearing it up. On pace for a triple double, dude decided to hit me with the rage quit. He just, he got really sloppy, he started throwing the turnovers, and yeah, I mean, we were obviously going to take advantage and get those easy buckets. Uh, so yeah, I wish the game would have gone the full length. I'm pretty sure I would have had a, a, a triple double with Chris Webber, possibly a 40 point gameplay with him. Is he worth the price? The answer to me is yes. Uh, one, because you don't have to lock him in, right? So if the card is optionable, you don't got to lock him in like you do for the Draymond. Two, you're going to be able to do the XP challenges for him. And if you don't like the card, you can always sell him back. So, yeah, I would say pick him up. Whatever he's going for, just pay it. See if you're good with the card. And if you don't like it, you know, take a little bit of an MT loss and, and sell him back. But that's going to be it for the video, man. Hopefully you enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to drop a like, man. Hit that subscribe button. We are on the grind to 32K subs. It's your boy, Decentric, man. I'm checking out.